What's up, everybody? I'm Evie Star here with Evie Star Music and Blank TV with Matt Brandenberry from from Asha to New. I think I mispronounced your last name. You were close. It was good. It was good. good. You know, you got better than most people. So <laughs> I tried. You did it. Cool. Uh, what's up, man? How's it up there? Hot. Hot. It was dope, though. We had a great crowd. Everyone was into it. I could you hear it? Yeah. Right on. That's good. How did you get done? So good. Your dad is doing much better. Yeah, yeah. He's kicking. So you know the surgery. It was a success and uh, yeah. Last time I saw you guys had to actually drop off. Yeah. I think you saw us at our last day, yeah. my last show and I flew in from Atlanta the next day. So, yeah. Exactly. Yep. Well, I think you guys are still doing it. You're still gone up the charts and your songs just came out with a new one, Lost and Alone. Yep, Lost and Alone. Um, I think it becomes an official single at the end of May. Right. Um, something like that. We're working the video right now. So. They can, but they can reel it online, right? If they want somebody to post their music. Oh, it's for sale. Okay. Yep, you can. It's it's, uh, it's on day one, so you pick up day one, and Lost and Alone's on there. Right. Same with through it all, obviously. Sweet. Thank you. I really don't have a whole lot of questions because I know you basically are hitting up the head. Well, how many times have we shot the shit already? You know what I mean? I know, man. That's why you're out of questions already. <laughs> it's like I talk to you, and we talk, and we you know we're friends, so it's kind of yeah. hard to come up with an on the spot like business question for a buddy. <laughs> why did you name your band from Ashes to New? It's been sitting there. I love that. Thank you. Like, building and going all over. That's why I said on stage today, like, everyone told us not to do what we're doing. Everyone told us to, you know, like, who the fuck are you? Like, why, why are you doing this rap rock thing? Why are you putting rap with rock? It's, it's over. It's dead. No, it's not. They're just... Not, yeah, I, mean, I think the thing is, is there just hasn't actually been a whole lot of bands that did it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like... It's all good. Okay. We're going to keep doing our thing the way we've always done our thing. You know, everybody else is going to say, Absolutely. And we got, you know, we, we, you can just level it out. We've got way many more lovers than we do haters, so. But you know what? The haters are the ones that spread the word more. I've always said that. I've said exactly much. You don't let them hate. Because the people that are telling their phone, you know, look at them like, I have and they're going to go find out what's up. Yeah, so it's cool, but you know, there's we have so much support and so many people that are behind us, and the fans are amazing. And because it was 11 7, I want to actually personally say thank you to 11 7 and Graham Bowen for the food. Yeah, they're great people. Graham's a great guy, and you know, like I said, the team behind us, they're they're killer, they all believe in us. Our, our fans, which you know, they're looking out up there. Actually, that show that we went to in Pittsburgh that you played in Pittsburgh, that's the first ever rock show. I've seen in four years. I love that Really? That's awesome. And most everybody that I have, they didn't say they're a bad band. That's good, you know. I mean, we were we were on tour with great bands too, you know. So, yeah. That's good. I mean, that's you know, we've got a message to get across in our music. We're we're not out here just doing it to do it. You know what I mean? So it's good that people are, are grabbing onto that message and it means something to them. You know? It really does. I mean, your song, you just talked, you know, like cool it off with. I mean, it's such an anthem that gets the when you need a pick me up. You know? That's what it's there for. Yeah. It works. And the whole line, fuck the words. It's just be friends. It's like, like you end a relationship or something. You've been in for so long with somebody. Like, oh, we should just be friends. Like, you know that that's not happening. It's not. <laughs> happening. Like, you can't go from that. No, you can't. You can't. So. So yeah, I mean, we're, we're stoked. Like, we just, we're, we're fortunate to be out here. Most of the dudes in the band had given up on their musical endeavors. You know. Uh, yeah, we're back out. We're doing it. I like most of the bands. We've only been out for a couple years, and you have literally just been. And, it, and it's growing by the thousands every day and like I said we couldn't be more appreciative everyone that comes in just you know the, the new fans that come in every day like oh my god you know like we found you guys by mistake like it, we get a lot of people like we found you guys by accident on YouTube or something like that and it's like you know they're, they're really they're really happy that they found us and we're really happy as well so oh yeah so we start our tour with Hell Yeah tomorrow. Okay. 
Yep. Yeah. So the Hell Yeah Escape the Fate New Year's Day. It's called the We're All in This Together Tour. Yeah. And we start tomorrow in Baltimore, which is like a 13-hour drive from here. Yeah, yeah so we're, like, we're going to finish up here, and then we have some other things that we got to do here at the festival, and then it's just skate out and get to Baltimore. Yeah, that's awesome. But, you know, at least you'll get there and be able to rest stuff Yeah, and it's close to home, too, so it's going to be cool because the first three shows of the tour, we'll be able to kind of, like, hop back and forth between home and the venues. So. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. It's, it's This is the first time in a long time that we've toured anywhere close to home. So I think the last time we actually toured was with Five Finger Death Punch, and we ended the tour at the Rock Allegiance Festival in Philly. Yeah, that was our, no, I'm saying that was the last tour that we toured close to home. So, um, and then before that was our first tour with Hollywood Undead last March, so we don't go close to home very often, so people are really happy to see that we're... Yeah, we live in Pennsylvania, absolutely. Uh, Amish country. I didn't know it was Amish country, but it's a dance It's Amish country. I think we talked about that with a couple of your band members last year. If you ever go to Pennsylvania, eat the Amish food. Do it. It's the best decision you'll ever make. The Amish women? The Amish women? I mean, I don't think we look at them that way. So they kind of keep to themselves. All of them. But they, you know, they're awesome. Blame them. You guys are better. No. I'm only teasing. These guys are actually really cool. We try. Hey, people. You can find them online, guys. It is literally so Ashes. Two new, four different words, no misspellings, no confusions. And if you search them, Siri or Google will find them for you. I promise. <laughs> and if you don't go by their music, it's seriously your loss because I can tell you, I love it. Thank you. Love it, love it, love it. Thank you. And I can't wait for the rest of it comes out so I can have more and more and more. Uh, yeah, we can't wait to, you know, I mean, obviously we just released our first record day one and yeah. we're already writing songs, so it's first like, you know. First sticker on my computer, Justin. There's like yeah? a scene. Nice. That's just new day one. Hell yeah. I like it. I look at it every day like, you know, I'm going to start over at day one. That's what it is. That's what it's all about. You know, being yourself and just doing what you want to do. Believe in yourself and don't let other people tell you what you can and cannot do. We're out here playing. Last year we were here, we we opened the smallest stage here. This year we just opened the biggest stage here, so... You know. well, we got the stars, and we just you. Nah, you got to shoot for the stars. Shoot for the men. The men do still win. Mm-hmm. Anyway, I'm going to let Matt get on with his day so they can get on with that long ass stuff <laughs> up, up 95. Um, but thanks for your time, Matt, and I'm so glad that you got to play for everybody today and that yes, we got to chat with you again. Likewise, thanks for having me. All the family's all healthy and happy. Good to be better. Oh, yeah. Nice breeze, nice view. Right? It's amazing right now. <laughs> Especially Should've after getting off stage yesterday. and dying. So. <laughs> I can only imagine what it's like up there. Woo, brutal. We're playing Warp Tour this year, so. I might actually be coming. It's like a pre- Precursor to Warp Tour. We're just trying to get ourselves in shape to do that tour. Yeah, it's, if I have a couple Warp Tour, I'm definitely gonna have to start hitting the gym every day. I'm gonna be a completely different looking person by the end of that. That would be my plan too. <laughs> I'll be hiding behind like branches on trees and stuff. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna lose like 20 pounds on that tour. So you'll probably sweat it right off. Yeah, the stage. yeah, it's, it's gonna be fun. brutal, but you know we're looking forward to it. It's gonna be fun. Warp Tour's always dirty, but it's always so fun. We're on the whole thing, so it's gonna be awesome. On. Well, if you miss them out on the festival circuit or out with their tour with Hell Yeah New Year's Day and it's been great. Make it out to work there, guys, but make sure you check them out. Matt, thank you thank for you. everything, and I appreciate it, and I just need one more thing, it's for you to look at that camera and tell them your name, your band, and that they're watching Blank TV. Blank? Oh, hey, look at that! So, guys, I'm Matt with From Ashes to New, and you're watching Blank TV. Thanks, Matt. Oh, you're welcome.